Good morning, everybody. Good morning. Happy Wednesday morning. So I am just kind of beside myself. I'm thrilled. I'm surprised. Um, this box that I'm about to open, I have not looked inside, but it's from Angela Toma. And if you haven't seen her channel, y'all go over and check out her channel. She's Right now, she's doing a couple really cool projects. She did some small 3x3s using up a whole 12x12 12 12 sheet. And then um, she's doing an accordion book using the shabby rose papers from, are they Stamperia? Can't remember. Anyway, it's gorgeous. Um, and I'm glad she's doing YouTube videos again. She took a little break. So glad to have you back, my dear. Well, Angela had mentioned that she had some little palms. She says, I have some little palms. Do you want them for your book? I said, yeah, for my palmistry book. Yeah. And she said, okay, I'll drop them in the mail. Well, I have a feeling this is a little bit more than a couple of little Tim Holtz palms. So, Angela, thank you very much. It's so sweet of you. I don't know what's inside. Ooh. Hmm. OMG. What? I have this box upside down because all of our addresses and Oh, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh, Angela, look at this paper. I'm doing a shabby chic journal next. <laughs> I've been wandering around my room going, what am I gonna do? What am I gonna do? Oh, wow. Oh, sweetheart, thank you so much. Oh, I, I don't have this paper. Mm. Wonderland. Oh, gorgeous. Okay, so this was in there like this with this. So, let's look. Oh, hello. Wow. Look at that card. A few little gifts for you. Yeah, I, uh, I think so. What a sweet card. It says, Dear Carol, I'm sure enjoying your videos. You really sparked my creativity with the file folder journal. I tried to get this in the mail sooner, but um, Omnicron is spreading like wildflower here. It is too here, kid. We um, have canceled a whole bunch of stuff we had planned. Well, not a whole bunch, but yeah. I hope this doesn't touch your lives as well. Oh, several of our adult kids and grandchildren are down with it. No! Oh, gosh, I hope they're vaccinated. I hope this doesn't touch your life lives as well. So stay well and away from colds and flu. I am. Thank you so much for all the great videos. You're sure an angel with all your challenges and gifting of journals and such. Hugs, Angela Toma. Oh, Angela, that is so sweet. I don't know if you made this card or what, but it is gorgeous. Oh, I might, I might use this as inspiration to use my new markers. That is beautiful. Angela, thank you for such kind words. I appreciate it from you very, very much. And um, I love making videos just like you do. I love your videos as well. This is cool. My gosh, girl. Wow. Oh my land. Oh, oh my gosh, she sent a whole kit. Well, I know what I'm gonna be doing. Oh my gosh. There they are, oh, these are great. Oh, these are gonna be perfect, kid. Ooh, love it. Look at all these goodies. Oh. 
Oh my gosh, Angel, this is so precious. You didn't have to do this, but I'm happy you did. Ooh. Oh my gosh, look at all this stuff. These, some of these are Tim Littles, I recognize them. I call them Littles, I don't, I don't know. Oh my gosh, look at that. <laughs> oh. I, a lot of these I have never seen before. Oh my gosh. Oh, that is so sweet. You know, the YouTube community just continues all the time to just amaze me with generosity and the kindness of people who, if not for these little videos that we do, we wouldn't even know each other, and I'm so grateful that we do. <clears throat> oh, wouldn't that be nice in a traveling journal? Ooh. Love this. Uh-huh. Yeah. Oh, my mind is just going, going, going. Look at these book pages. I will ship the radio Friday night, and I think I'll prepay. This is 1941. Ooh. And there's several pages. Hmm. Ooh, my mind is just spinning. I gotta get these little hands out of here because they're going in this book. I feel a little greedy. I wanna keep one for myself. I think I, well, there's, there's several. I think I'll put two of them in the book, two for me. That's the hoarder in me going, oh, I can't give it away, not all of it. I mean, I love you and everything. And I want to share, but I don't want to share all, everything. <laughs> is that greedy? I don't know if it is or not. Oh, yeah. I've seen these in the antique stores. I think I have something kind of like it. I love them. Love them. These are going to be great in a traveler's journal as well. Mm. Are there actually negatives in here? Feels like there's something in here. I always look when I'm in the antique stores because, you know, people hid money in weird places. Phone is 395. Something drug company. Cool. Gosh, those are awesome. Woohoo! Oh, what is this? Hmm. Oh my gosh, it's handwriting. <laughs> we should keep this. The kids of the future are going to need these. <laughs> we need to keep these. <laughs> Look, my mom knows how to write and code. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, this is great. Oh my gosh. Wow, this is a great find. Oh, this paper is uh, old, really old. Oh, wow. Oh, don't get ahead of yourself. Ooh. I don't have anything like this. I've been going to estate sales before COVID, trying to find things like this. I couldn't find anything, but this is awesome. Oh, I can totally see this in the signature. Oh, thank you so much for sharing, Angela. Mm. Mm. What is this? Jewelry? A gentleman's gold-plated scarf pin. Ooh. Be nice to get the circle punch and punch one of these and then put, uh, um, what's it called? 
clear glossy accents on top. Oh, this is old, really old. Mm. Wow. Oh my gosh. Look at this. This is going on the cover. This is cover material. Looks like rice paper with string. Don't know where you got this girl, but this was one heck of a find. It looks like some type of fiber, a filter maybe? If it isn't, I just thought of that. Wouldn't that make a, you know, you know how the, the filters in the furnaces, they don't look this cool, but they do have this. Wow. Oh, there's the cover. Oh, wow. Now I'm really getting excited. Ooh. Vellum. Look at all this. Ooh. Mmm. Handmade paper. Rice paper. Handmade paper. Handmade rice paper. Gorgeous. Look at that gold. Oh, gosh. Oh. Wow. This is gorgeous. Um, Stamperia just does a beautiful job with her rice paper. Look at, this is all going to go together. What a great kit. Wow. Gosh, look at the paper. Oh my land, look at that paper. Oh, I love this Rick Rack. Makes me want to cry, I get teary. It's really sweet of you, Angela. It's so sweet. I'm so happy to have my channel and to be meeting people. I was just talking to one of my dear friends today that I don't think it's I don't think it's just coincidental that we connect. I I think all these relationships they they're valuable to me and I appreciate all of them. Every single one of you guys. I I really do. I really am grateful to be connected with you all. Oh, this has some heft to it. It's nice. Oh, look at that. Oh! <gasps> That's hand spun. This is hand spun. Oh my gosh, it's gorgeous. Oh! Oh, Angela, this is beautiful. Oh, my gosh. Oh, look. That, I think that is silk. Am I right? It's beautiful. When did you make this? Did I see this video? <laughs> oh. Wow. Wow. Look at this, y'all. Oh. 
Oh, it's just gorgeous. It's just gorgeous. This is straw paper from Rachel. Oh, I meant to tell you, Shannon, that straw paper from Italy is from Rachel at um, is it Roxy Creations? I always get her and Tracy Fox mixed up. But it's Rachel. She has an Etsy site, and that's where I got the straw paper. What a cool little book. Oh, my gosh. This is just so kind of you. All this work and... Mm. Look at this. Look at this. Mm. Oh, all the details. Oh my gads. Look at this, y'all. Oh. oh. Wow. Thank you so much, Angela. This is just, it, this really really steals my heart. Um, I, I am very touched, very touched. Girl, did you do that? You got to do a video. I don't know how to do that. <gasps> wow. <clears throat> this all looks like Shannon's paper. You all seen Shannon's tea dyeing? It's like this. It's Oh, Angela, this is gorgeous. Do you have this on your Etsy? Wow. Oh. Oh my gosh, look at this, y'all. Mm. Mm, this is one of my favorite colors. This mustard color, this caramel. I want a leather sofa in this color. Oh. Perfect size. Perfect size. I've never seen this paper. I love it. Wow, look at all this detail. You know what's hitting me? I have never been given a journal. I've never bought myself a journal like this, you know, online or anything, and I've never been given one. And it just, it's dawning on me, this is what people feel like when we make our journals and we give them to somebody. It's, I'm awestruck. That's what it is. I'm awestruck. Even though I make journals, I make cards, you know, I bind things and match color and texture and things. And, but... There is something magical about the detail that somebody has gone to and then gives you this special part of their imagination and creativity. I believe that. Nothing happens unless we first dream. Yeah. Oh. Wow. I don't know what this paper is. I've never seen it before, but I love it. Love it. Yeah, it's, uh, this is really special, really special. And I'm going to use this journal. I'm not going to just put it away on a shelf. I'm going to use it. 
I'm going to work in it. I may draw in it. It's sparking my imagination to kind of draw a little bit. Maybe use my markers. Look at these. Oh, I'm going to use these in my shabby chic journal. I can see how if you were to give somebody a beautiful journal, a work of art like this, they wouldn't want to disturb anything or change anything. I I can see that. because It seems almost like sacrilegious or... Ooh, nice chipboard. But I know that these books are meant to be used and so... I just love it. Well, Angela, you have really touched my heart. Um, big hugs, lady, big hugs. Thank you very much for thinking of me and, and sending this beautiful package. Um, I'm... I'm very grateful. Thank you for your friendship and all your support for my channel. And um, if you all have not gone and checked out Angela Thomas' channel, you need to. She's very talented. She did a recipe book um, that was out of this world. She is very detail-oriented. Her books are, as you can tell, they're sturdy and solid and well made and well thought out and um oh there's a pocket there's a secret pocket to hide all my money oh good it's not near big enough angela <laughs> i'm gonna take this downstairs and play with it um thank you sweetheart you're a good friend, and I value our friendship, and I'm glad to see you back on YouTube. Um, I, yeah, uh, we missed you. We missed you. So, um, and you know, Angela, I would love to put a kit together for you to do the channel challenge, if you want to. I know you're pressed for time. I didn't want to pressure you. I thought about when I saw you back on, your channel, I got a little giddy and thought, oh, I need to send her a kit. But I know you're cramped for time, and I know that, you know, you've got other things in the works. You're doing the um, Marguerite Miller thing, and, and oh, yuck, I cannot wait to get started. Um, but I would love for you to join the challenge. Um, we did have somebody changed their mind. Annie Creates was going to do the challenge, and she said, you know, I just don't think I can do it. So um, I do have room for another kit, and if you'd like to do it, please comment below, and I will get your kit out. Right now I'm doing Martha's kit, so yours I would be putting together probably next week. Um, and if you have any questions about that, let me know. Don't feel pressured. I know you've got a lot going on. And I know how it is to, you have all these challenges you want to do and, and it gets really overwhelming and you feel kind of compelled. Don't feel that way. If you want one, I'm happy to send you one. Um, it would really truly be my privilege to send you a kit. So if you'd like one, um, and there's no rush, you just do it at your leisure. Um, there's really no rules except video the thing and the process and then give it away, have a giveaway at the end. Um, but I'm really loving the um, networking with everybody and helping everybody grow their channels. If you'd like to do that, I would love to send you a kit. Thank you again, very sweet. Ah, okay. That was fun. All right, so. Next up, I know what this is, but it doesn't, doesn't make me any less excited. This is, I splurged for myself and bought Mixed Media Minnesota kit. I've actually bought a few of Shannon's kits from Mixed Media Minnesota. And... Um,
they're always wonderful. And the thing I love about her kits is they're normally things that I look at to buy or I see someone using and think, oh my gosh, I'd love to try that. But I don't. And she kind of puts it all together in a kit that says, here you go. Shannon is the queen of dyeing paper, y'all. I mean, look at that. Oh, I have to take a deep breath. Look at her paper. Look at this paper. Can you hear it? I was actually going to go buy some. I was just going to wait for a little bit because I've been a little spend happy, you know. The packages come fast and furious, and I can't convince my husband that they were all gifts. <laughs> he knows. <laughs> so I was going to wait a little bit, and then I was going to go get some of your paper. Thank you so much. Oh, this is going to go great in my new book. Oh. Can we just take a second to look at this? Mm. Grateful. Yeah, I am. Very grateful. Grateful for your friendship, my dear. Okay, here's her kit. Now, I have not done the three-month subscription, but I always wish I had. Um, I actually, before I bought my first kit, or was it, I don't remember, but anyway, it's been quite a while ago, a year, year and a half, I went and priced everything that she included in the kit. I'm telling you, it's cheaper to buy the kit because you, she gives you things that if you had to go buy them retail, A, you'd pay more, and B, you have to buy more in bulk. Like uh, some of the papers, you know, you have to buy the entire kit. So, what Shannon has done, I think it's brilliant, it's brilliant, is she has put together a themed kind of kit that you can use every bit of, and you don't have to go to the expense of buying stuff that you're going to end up hoarding. You know, leftovers that don't make a complete kit, that kind of thing. And I love it, I love it. So I saw this kit. I didn't get the last kit because I had everything. I had those papers and I had the paste, I think, and I had similar um, embellishments, but I don't have any of this. I don't have this. Oh my gosh. Oh, and if you haven't used this Tim Holtz um, paper, collage paper, I have it in different colors. I don't have this pattern, this black and white, and it's going to go gorgeous in this journal. Um, but this is fun stuff to work with. Good job including that. What is this? A palette for this and this, maybe, huh? Collage medium. It's a collage palette, right? This is like, um, oh, you know. Not vinyl, but uh, anyway, nice, fun little tool. I do not have these colors. Yum. Yum. Nice job, Shannon. You really did a good job putting this kit together. I love, I love the burnt, minty, sort of vintage, sun-bleached green. Is that a color? <laughs> <laughs> Are they vellum? Transparent wings. Ooh. Wow, look at those. I can't get it open. Y'all know I have issues with the fact that the hangers at the top and the openings at the bottom. Yeah, I have I have issues. 
to me that's a design flaw because once the stickum is abused you go to hang it up and everything falls out the bottom i'm just saying when i get to run the world it's gonna we're gonna do that different oh yeah oh look at that y'all mm -hmm. yeah i'm sure you could color that with some alcohol markers there's just so much you could do leave it blank it's gorgeous yeah oh nice job shannon Mixed Media Minnesota. Now, Shannon is participating in the challenge, the channel challenge, and she's doing a spring book, and what she's done with this book is amazing. I love the insert that you did. Um, I think I've done something similar to that, but it didn't turn out like yours, and I'm really inspired by the way yours is so tailored, and it's, it's just sweet. It's beautiful. Love your card, kid. Look at what we got here. Oh, what is this? Step, uh, steps of transfer. What? Butterfly washi tapes. Oh, I've never done this. Cut the pattern. Remove the clear sheet, dip the white sheet in water in a flat bowl, place the wet sheet in upside down manner on a clean surface. Okay. Gently dab the sheet against the surface with damp sponge and carefully slide the whole sheet from the film. Do not touch the transferred film with your hands. Let it dry. Seal with seal the transfer with acrylic varnish or a good sealer. Never done this before. This is going to be fun. This would be gorgeous on rice paper or... Oh, yum. Boy, my mind is going nuts. Oh, yum. Simple stories. I love simple stories. These are stickers. Mmm, love it. Yeah, this is a color palette that I... I don't have, I don't think I have, oh, there's a wing. A broken wing, isn't that a song somehow? Even with a broken wing, she flew. Where I go? Take her broken wings and learn to fly. Yeah. Pretty. It's like a love story. Yeah. Oh. Oh my gosh. This reminds me of beautiful wallpaper. Mm. It is John Young Fine Roses from Simple Stories. Weathered Garden. That's what it looks like. Yeah. Love this. Love it. Oh my gosh. Oh, that's going to be hard to decide what side to use. Oh, wow, I think we have a cover. Oh, my gosh. Oh. Oh, how do I decide? Oh, this is going to be tough. Hmm, we may have two books in the making, guys. I think it's going to be two books. Hmm. Wow, love this. Love it, love it, love it. Beautiful. Simple stories. This is great, great paper. What is that? Is that a bee? A butterfly? What is it? A moth? Pretty. Love it. Mm. That's a beautiful cover. Well, girl, this is a great kit. I can't wait. Um, gosh, there's so much here. I, I really think we've got two books in the making. 
thank you again for this little add-on. This was not included in the kit, I don't believe. This was an add-on gift. Thank you very much. Shannon, you're so sweet. So sweet. I'm so excited about your wedding. Isn't it like in two days or something? Hey, don't you apologize for a courthouse wedding. I told the story the other day of my wedding. It was a courthouse wedding, and the judge forgot he was supposed to marry us, so he wasn't there, and I thought for sure it was a sign. And I looked at my husband, and he kind of was like thinking it was a sign too, like, oh, maybe I'm not going to get married today. And then um, his sister had a friend from church who worked at the courthouse, and she saw her in the hallway and said, hey, hey, is your judge busy? And she goes, no, nah, I don't know, why? Well, the, my sister-in-law, my future sister-in-law, my brother were supposed to get married, but the judge forgot, it's not on his calendar, he's not here, and she goes, I'll go ask him. So she went and asked the judge she worked for, and he said, yeah, I'll marry him, send him in. <laughs> so there we went in our two tight shoes with smiles, and I was two and a half months pregnant with my daughter. So I tease everybody that we had an old-fashioned wedding, shotgun. Yeah, it was, we laugh about it all the time. And I love him just as much now, even more, than I did then. So don't you ever feel like you need to apologize for a courthouse wedding. Yep, nothing to apologize for. Guys, I've taken up enough of your time. I, I, I'm really overwhelmed with all of the generosity um it's really it means a lot to me it really does i mean that from the bottom of my heart it really does and so i think i've got two journals in the mix now um and i can't wait to dig into them and they're going to be similar types of journals um feminine pretty lacy vintage uh, the one from Angela's kit is going to be a little more <clears throat> fairy tale maybe um, but still um, they're gonna have a lot of lace a lot of femininity to them and they'll both be for sale so if you want to watch that process, um, I am going to take this downstairs and go play with it. Um, thank you again, both of you. Uh, and Angela, you just hit me up, girl. I have an extra kit. So if you would like it, I'd be happy to put it together and get it over to you. And I will get these little palms put in the book, courtesy of you. They'll be perfect. All right, guys, let's all take care of each other, especially now. Bye.